Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, I'm Lauren Piesco. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. Police say one man shot another man driving on I-675 in Carleton Township. Court records show 23-year-old Kamari Hopkins is charged with one count of assault. Carlson Township Police Chief says it all started with an argument at Denny's in Saginaw. 21-year-old man left the restaurant with a woman, and that's when police say Hopkins chased after them on 675. They had Hopkins shot at the car, hitting the man in his lower back. And another man in Tuscola County facing several charges accused of shooting at Michigan State Police Troopers. State police say they were helping Vassar Police with a domestic violence complaint on Wednesday night on Irish Road in Millington Township. When they got there, police say the man started shooting at them. When backup arrived, they used flashbangs and the man was arrested and taken to jail. Holly Dazzle kicks off tonight at the Renaissance Festival Fairgrounds in Holly. You can check out all of the festive lights, meet Santa, ride the Holly Dazzle Express, and join the Polar Pup Crawl. It runs every weekend through December. For tickets, just go to the Hotlink section on our website. Now here's Matthew with a look at your forecast. Thank you, Lauren. And as we go through the rest of this Black Friday and Thanksgiving weekend here, we are tracking some colder, blustery weather across mid Michigan. Wind chills for today only into uh, the mid to upper teens. Highs up to about 32 degrees, but those wind chills staying on the colder side just because of a west wind gusting to 30 miles per hour. We have woken up to some light snow here in parts of mid Michigan this morning, especially our southern area. So please drive safely if you are heading out. But fortunately, in these air temperatures, our roads salt does work very effectively. So as that salt goes down, we should see our roads improving somewhat quickly here as we go through the morning. But this lake effect just continues through today, tonight, and as we go into tomorrow too. So we're still stuck under this very persistent pattern, which is keeping the colder weather around for us too. But these snow showers have been heavier, especially just outside of the TV5 viewing area, particularly to our north, closer to Grayling and Gaylord. If you have to travel there through this weekend, please drive safely because I-75 has been quite a mess. There's actually a winter storm warning in those spots. First Lord 7 day forecast is more chances of snow really all the way into next week with high staying in the low 30s on Wednesday as well. Next week we could have a clipper move through that brings even more accumulating snow. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather and information.